From high atop Healthcare Hill in Central Maryland, this is BSN Headline News. Today's top story is open enrollment is in full swing. Yes, all benefits eligible employees should know that open enrollment is going on now through July 25th, 2014. So what does that mean for you? Well, this year, as in the past, all benefits eligible employees are required to enroll for next year's medical, dental, and vision plans to be covered in the new plan year. That plan year starts September 1st, 2014. So if you haven't made your choices yet, now would be a good time to get things going and make the right choices for you and your family. By now, everyone should have received their open enrollment packet in the mail. If you have not, go to Ask HR. All the materials included in the packet are available on Ask HR. Otherwise, review your packet, ask any questions you have, then go to bishigoodchoices.com and enroll. So here is a quick rundown of the top things you should know for open enrollment this year. Open enrollment dates are now through July 25th. Coverage dates for the new plan begin September 1st, 2014. Aetna is still our medical plan administrator. Medical, dental, and vision plan enrollment is mandatory. That means even if you currently have coverage, you still need to re-enroll during open enrollment to be covered even if you do not want to make any changes. By completing all three wellness incentives by August 31st, you earn $900 to be deposited in your new health reimbursement account or HRA. Oh, the HRA replaces the 2013 payroll credit. You need to go to bishigoodchoices.com to enroll and Choose the best plan for you and your family. Enrollment for voluntary benefits will be in the fall, so don't worry about voluntary benefits for this enrollment. Well, that's the basics. If you need to know more, and I'm sure you do, please go to one of the many benefit fairs going on at your local system. You can also go to Ask HR online, and don't forget, your benefits up close on IRIS on the BC Welcome page. Open enrollment is going on now through July 25th. Don't miss out. Go to bishigoodchoices.com and enroll today. In other news, hand washing. Now that doesn't sound very exciting. That's why we need your help. The BC Healthcare Acquired Infections Clinical Transformation Team has just announced a hand hygiene campaign contest. Still not excited? Well, listen up. We invite any and all BC employees to develop and submit ideas for an exciting hand washing campaign. That's right, posters, screensavers, badge clips, maybe a video. But it's the idea we're looking for. The best ideas will then be turned into those things, posters, screensavers, badge clips, or maybe a video, by corporate communications. You know who you are. So let's get creative. The Bonsacore Healthcare Acquired Infections Clinical Transformation Team is asking you to send your ideas to your local infection control leader by July 25th. If you don't know who your local infection control leader is, just send your ideas to me. I'll be happy to get them in front of the right people. But whatever you do, do it before July 25th. It's the first ever hand hygiene campaign contest. Finally, have you heard about nurses for good? Or how about giving circles? Well, both are happening in Bon Secours, Virginia today, and they want to share the idea with everyone. Now, giving circles are not new. The concept is fairly straightforward. Essentially, there is power in giving together. For Bon Secours Virginia and Nurses for Good, if 1,000 nurses give $100 each, we can create a $100,000 transformative grant. So, how does it work? 
Well, that's pretty straightforward as well. 1,000 nurses give $100 each to create a $100,000 grant. Nurses submit project proposals. Now, project proposals might be a program or initiative that will have long-lasting change across the Bon Secours Virginia Health System. Then, Nurses for Good members vote on proposals. Finally, the $100,000 grant is awarded to support the winning program or initiative. And now for the big news. The first Nurses for Good grant for 2014 has been given to Phyllis Turner, MSN, RNBC, PCCN, in the category of lifelong learning for Bon Secours Virginia Certification University. The program hopes to establish a certification library at each Bon Secours Virginia facility, complete an e-library bibliography for nursing exams, establish a certification site on IRIS, host four certification test preps with external speakers and increase the number of Bon Secours Virginia certified nurses. You can get the complete story and find out how you can contribute or how you can start your own giving circle on Bon Secours Virginia Foundation's website at bsvaf.org slash nurses for good. Giving circles and nurses for good. Just one more way. We are good help to those in need. Well, that's it for this week. Stay tuned to this portal for future up-to-the-minute information on these and other stories on BSN Headline News. I'm Dave Schlachter. Thanks for joining us. BSN Headline News is a production of Bomb Secure Productions and is solely responsible for its content.